The Renfilly Shield retains a magical spot in New Zealand rugby, and this afternoon here at the Hutt Recreation Ground, Wellington the holders put the Hello Trophy on the line against Southland. So it will be Southland with the ball in the hands of Greg Dyer as referee Ben O'Keefe blows the whistle, and away we go. And the kickoff goes down to Patafilo, and off it goes for Keelan Whitman, the number eight forward. Wellington playing with the wind in the first half. On halfback, Kyle Preston gets it up nice and high. And safe under the high ball was Van Voet, the fullback. And uh, Southland in possession. So now Taylor to throw to the line out, finding Singh near the back. Plenty of height in the Southland line out as well. Nicely taken up by Nell. Now back for Dyer. Oh, he's under a bit of pressure and kick is slewed off the side of his boot, but it's been taken down nicely by Filiami Finney on the right wing ceiling. side, but then Southland have yeah, infringed. Right Number 15, on your feet, please, no ceiling. So here's the first kick for TJ Clark. And he's got it up nice and high, and he's drifted it in well. And so Wellington on the board after seven and a bit minutes, and they lead by three to nil. Five metres out. Short pass from Joe Walsh. Wellington defence holding up, but still playing under this penalty advantage. Another crack at the Wellington defence. Can't get over the ball. Now Taylor goes again. And nothing doing there, so Ben O'Keefe is going to have a chat to... Down here, not rolling, and then number one was ever back. So it's just the discipline in the 22. They can't slow the ball down legally like that. Thanks. Next one's a yellow. All right. Well, you're here to win the shield. Absolutely. And uh, passing up a guaranteed three, really. Now, yeah, here's a nice move near the front of the line out. And South and Threaten again, going very close. And held up. Ball was over the line here. It moved over then back. It's held up, so it's a goal line dropout. Well, that finishes up being a pretty good result for Wellington. It's now having to go as well. He's hard to stop, so it must have been a very good piece of defence, and it was. You could see O'Reilly gets underneath and he can't quite get enough momentum to get it over and... Again, Taylor, how many times have we seen him drag it up in the first 16 minutes of the game? Singh now, almost to the 10-metre line. Van Voet, not afraid to come up and have a crack at the line. Wellington have turned it over. So here's a chance for Wellington. Uramia sends it away to Patafilo, and he's got a ton of speed, and the left winger, against the run of play, has scored. Here's Van Voet. There's the tackler there, and he doesn't roll away, doesn't get off the play, and then Karifi gets over the top, so possibly quite fortuitous there, but then they got it out to Patafilo, and he was always going to have too much gas. Southland couldn't adjust to the turnover, and Wellington strike. Taylor looking to throw. One by Blair Ryle. Wellington collapsing it, so it's a penalty advantage. He should not have done that. I was about to say that. That's cynical around the side. You're well offside. Ten minutes. So ten minutes in the bin for Dominic Ropati. And look, honestly, you could see him hovering there. They'd already conceded the penalty from pulling down the line-out drive. And they were under, obviously, a warning. All Ben O'Keefe needed was somebody to do something cynical. Penalty count high. Now, here comes the south and again. Nice pass off to Funga, plowing his way through a couple of tackles. Now Renton. Gets there quickly. Oh, and it bounces away off the shoulder. I think, oh, maybe he got a fingertip to it. Blair Ryle. And a real opportunity there for Southland. Right by the goalposts. And Blair Ryle has lost it. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, oh they scored a try. What a fantastic scrum. Well, as you mentioned, Ben, yeah. Wellington decided to back themselves with seven men, and it was catastrophic. Look at that power. Straight through that forward pack, scooped up, and Southland go in. Yeah, what's in here? Go, 
So Delaney wins the line out. And Wellington looked to put some pressure on. O'Reilly holding it up. O'Reilly still holding it up. Now they go. Just short. Southall looking to hold on here. Crack at the line by Whitman. Check. As Wellington go again. And Ben O'Keefe looking desperately. Yeah, it's up, so back for the penalty. So it's a penalty. They were playing a penalty Just advantage. Just hands are in front of the line, players offside. Looks like a good old-fashioned tap. So, Kariffi hands it across. And, oh, well done. And Delaney, I think, as he got it just short. He looked like he was in. In fact, he is in. All done in slow motion, but I think it's Caleb Delaney who scored the try. So, Kariffi across. I think the distributor was Whitman, and then nicely on to Delaney, and he had enough momentum to get the ball on the chalk. Well, nice little line from Rofetti here as well, who's just come back on. He was the one. He just took that defender. Well, Beno keeps in a good position where he is there. Nap. Now the, here is uh, Blair Ryle. And they showed him the touch line. And into touch he went. And that is half time. So it's been a really good first half. Played in quite difficult conditions here at the Hut Recreation Grounds. But at the break, Wellington with the win behind them in the first half, lead by 17 to 7. Fines! Sit! So Renton gets it in. Yep, balls out! Balls out, oh dear, that's a mistake by Southland. Here's Higgins. Is Wellington at possession, five metres out? Now a charge by Whitman. Good defence by Southland. Kariffi himself. It's Preston clears it out. Or oh. Preston goes again. Offside. Playing offside and heading for the corner is Higgins. And Riley Higgins puts it down in the corner for a Wellington try. But the transition work here is very good. The depth. Butterfilo comes in nice as well. Injection from Garden Bashup and Higgins quality finish. The yeah, quality hands here, isn't it? From the back line coming from depth and pace in the finish. Delaney got a hand on it. There it is uh, for Preston. Off to Patafilo. O'Reilly. Now Preston slings it back to the blind side. Where Orr takes it up. Preston again. Nice break here by uh, Ropetti. Number six charging down right five metres away. Now O'Reilly slings it wide. Nice hands from Proctor. Here's Garden Basham playing under advantage here. Short pass. Ball is there again. And now another crack at the line. Wellington threatening and they score. Wellington got it across to where Garden Bashup was, went short, and then another short line. And quickly, Ropetti picks it up from the base and dives over. Pops it up. And now here's Delaney down the middle. Just in Southland Territory, Hawati Parapara, away for Love. Nice, but in fact, this is Love. Now Love goes on his own, flicks it back. Can't link up, though. Higgins goes back and controls the ball. Now they go wide. Here's Proctor. Sends it wide for Numia. Southland have got themselves offside here. Hawati Parapara. Try something different. And oh my goodness! Oh, I think that's a try for Garden Bashup. <laughs> Boy, I just <laughs> think hardly anybody can believe it. It looked like Hawati Parapara had just kicked the ball away and was wanting the penalty. And he hit it really hard. It looked like it was going dead, but look at the bounce of the rugby ball. Never give up. Connor Garden Bashup. And he gets the job done somehow. He had to do so much there too. 
So the penalty has been kicked into touch and Strang throws. And they worked this move in the first half and it was pretty effective having a crack at the line. Uh, yes, a try scored. So it might have been Leroy Ferguson who got the try. The initial shift, it goes back. You can see to Bekuis. They get it really well set. Ferguson was on him so quickly. And then he recognised that, yes, it had gone to ground with Bekuis, but his momentum was still going forward, and he had enough of that to get himself over the line. And then, of course, as I mentioned earlier, the Ramphilly Shield game. Back at Sky Stadium. Biavana may well have finished by then. <laughs> well, still a few lying around under, yeah. the, under the seats or something. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Here's a nice run. Southland punishing down the left wing side. Morgan has to make the tackle. He can't make it. And Hamer Webb, that's a really nice try. That's the try of the day. Oh, it certainly is. Quality finish. They go to the left. Nice injection from the back. Equally really, really good, you can see from Funga. And then by the time that it went into the arms of Hammer Webb, he was that determined Wellington couldn't stop him. And they go to a second runner. Aoti Parapara, Lakai, held up. Just centimetres short, another go at the line. Ball still available quite clearly. And another crack. No, not there yet. Guys, hands up, hands up, Southern. Aoti Parapara. Slings it wide, Morgan over the top, it goes, and the try finally scored. And then Aidan Morgan, really nice summary of who to pick out. He had a player on the inside, Patafilo, in transition, but he went wide to the reserve hooker, South, who goes in, and that is a quality, quality finish for Wellington. And the game is over here at the Hutt Recreation Ground, and Wellington have successfully retained the log of wood. And, of course, have taken further championship points. They remain unbeaten in the MPC. They are the defending champions.